What if Cold War Zombies had year two content? And I'm not talking about Zombies Chronicles. We've already done a video on that. I'm more thinking about new original maps or additions to existing maps that are in Cold War already. And that's what we're going to be checking out today. So I went ahead and I downloaded this custom map called Dare Bunker, which is supposed to be the sequel to D Machina. And here in the description, it says in an alternate timeline, the Victus crew have been recruited by Requiem to investigate the abandoned bunker near Marsau, Poland. I'm assuming that's where D Machina is. Taking place just after the events of D Machina. Machina. Can our heroes come? We'll find out. The rest of the the rest of the description kind of cut out here. So we're going to go see if our heroes can come. Oh, this is sick. Hold on. Let me hide my face cam. They have a whole Cold War-esque like loading trailer here, like the loading cinematic. Of course, right, right when I start talking about it, it freezes. All right, there we go. Looks like we have the Cold War machines here. It is kind of, you know, freezing up on me, but I can see the vision here. Is that supposed to be elemental pop? That's a cool machine for it. And this, yeah, this does give D machine a vibes. All right, let's, let's hop into it. Oh, there's a wonder fist too. That's fun. Okay. Here we are on dare bunker. Oh, it has cold wars UI. I haven't installed any cold war mods or anything. This is all just built into the map. So this is pretty cool. We need an outbreak soon in this general area. Our sources think it has come from up in the mountain. We think there's an old pop up to the hill, but we aren't sure if it's still accessible. Okay, they kind of just, uh, like, lore dumped on me. Oh, of course, right when I start talking, they start talking. Hold on. To get the source, and I'll be in touch. Something about a source, and he'll be in touch. Something about going up the mountain, too. Who knows what horrors are lurking here? There's a reason we never came back. Was that supposed to be gray? It would have been cool if they could get the radio pop-ups to show up. But it does show, like, the points for every, like, melee we get. Do we still get points for shooting the zombies? Okay, we do. We got quick revive here. I'm gonna just scoop that right away. Oh, it's the cans. Let's go. This map is very dark already. And there's a shovel. Okay, so we need to look out for things that we can dig up. Oh, no. Okay. Nobody saw that. I think I should just restart. I'm restarting. All right, we're going to do that again like I didn't die. Come in, strike team. There's been a bit of a situation. There has been an outbreak soon in this general area. Our sources think it has come from up in the mountain. Oh, okay. So they're saying there's an outbreak source from up in the mountain. That's what we need to find. All right, let's see if there's any way for us to go. We can't go through these gates, it doesn't look like. I think the only spot we can go is through this door over here. All right, let's head through here. What we got going on? Oh, there's a trap. Oh, a shield part? We'll pick that up. What do we have here? There is a buildable shield. There's a key card, explosive, and fuses. I like that they have the whole Cold War, like, scoreboard and everything, too. That's pretty cool. Pretty nice feature to have. Stamina up looks like Cold War stamina up machine, too. Is this the rampage inducer in here? Nope, that's just a lantern. I also have so much ammo for this pistol. This is ridiculous. Oh, and there's crits. Did I get extra points for crits. Does it track crits? It does. Let's get some camos. Okay, let's make sure we're not missing any pieces to anything over here. Not looking like it, but there is a workbench. We can... Nope, that door needs power. What's going on outside? Nothing. It's just a little ledge. It looks like a box spawn. All right, what's through here? Oh, we made it outside. It's normally so beautiful when it snows here. But now it's just eerie. It's normally so beautiful when it snows here, and now it's just eerie. It's always been eerie. We have a crash plane and a village down here. Interesting. Is this penthouse? They resized penthouse. Oh, there's a fuse. I'll take that. And they got elemental pop here. At least this looks like the machine. What was the other machine I saw then? All right. I'm going to hit the box for my first weapon. Let's see what we get. I wonder if it's all Cold War weapons. Oh, I just saw the Mark II go by, actually. Cold War with the Mark II would be kind of sick. I guess we'll head up the mountain. She'll be coming around the mountain when she comes. There appears to be some sort of debris in the way. There should be a cabinet back in the bunker with some explosives in it. Maybe they could be of use. Okay, so it's saying I need explosives now back at the bunker to make my way up the mountain. So let's go look for those. I doubt they'd be anywhere where we we're already at because I feel like we would have seen them. But I'll look just in case. Yeah, it does not look like they're up here. I think they mean they want us to go down this way. But I'm too broke, so... Zombies, I'm gonna need you guys to leave. We shouldn't have enough money to make it through now. Where are those explosives at? Oh, there's electric cherry. So I'm assuming elemental pop does not have the electric cherry effect in this. They have an origins door here. Where are those explosives at? Also, this map is very dark. Kind of scary. We found another fuse. We just need one more. Here's jug. Oh, and here's power. Let's throw that on in that. Why is everything shaking? The lights actually come back on? They do! Cool. I thought they were going to just stay flickering. Honestly, I would have been fine with that, too. A little ambiance. What is... Oh, double tap looks so cool. Is this what it would have looked like if it was in Cold War? Or is that what, like, the leaked machine looked like? Because I think they were intending to put double tap in Cold War. But then they raised, like, the, the zombie health cap and everyone complained about it. And they, they pushed it back. And they put in, I think, death perception instead. Ooh, we have a dog round. 
Is it gonna be hellhounds? Is it gonna be plague hounds? Let's see. What's spawned here? Oh, they're, they're just hellhounds. Sick. I hate plague hounds. I'm gonna assume we need all the fuses to get the explosives, because right here it says we need all the fuses. This goes all the way to something. Cabinet appears to be electronically sealed. Okay. So we need to get in there. We need to find this last fuse. One was already over here, so I doubt it's gonna be too close to there we found one in penthouse we found one in the basement where would the last one be we've also only found one shield part i feel like we're we're missing a whole lot here i'm gonna wander around until i can find these parts oh i found the fuse it was right here it was not far off from where i was at let's throw our fuses in does that do anything take explosives got them oh oh it opened that up cool so now we use those explosives to get up the mountain let me double check that i'm not missing any shield parts down here i'm gonna assume there's gonna be at least one on the mountain but don't want to be wandering looking for another all right i couldn't find it i guess we're gonna have to wander later let's pop this open Oh, it's even like Cold War's explosives. And this is the machine I saw in the preview. What is this? Powerade punch? What does it say? 30% bullet damage, 50% explosive damage. Grenades split into three. Could be cool. I'll come back and grab that in a second. I want to explore a little bit. Oh, they got PhD. Oh, this keeps going up. We are way up in the mountains. Oh, they have the Wonder Fizz over here. Can, does it actually work? No way. And it has Cold War's whole thing. That's sick. Oh, I can dig. What you got for me? Just a gun. Cool, I don't want a DMR. I'm good, actually. I need these zombies to get out of here. There's a shield part. I knew one was going to be in the mountain. We just need one more. Why are these grayed out? Why can't I grab these from the Wonder Fizz? Oh, probably because I'm too broke for them. That would make sense. Oh, no. I got to get out of here. This is not the spot to be at. Give me this nuke. What is this? A zip line? Oh, it's like fast travel back down. Cool. I guess we'll grab our Powerade punch. Never mind, I'm broke, apparently. Yeah, it's 5,000. What the hell? That's an expensive perk. I still haven't found this breach they're talking about. I think they might be lying to me. Uh-oh. A lot of shit going on up here. Hold on, hold on. Okay, I'm down. I can still use my gun on the ground, though. This is bad. They're all bunched up down here. Please get out of my way. It's happening again. It's happening again. Eat a nade. Okay, I died. I'm gonna go ahead and run back through, get to where I was just at, and then we'll continue to try to figure out this map. All right, we're just about back to where we were at when I died. Uh, I have almost all the shield parts. I got all the fuses. We have the explosive now. I'm heading back up the mountain. I'm hoping that we have our last shield part up here. Uh, it seems like the spawns change every time, which is pretty cool, but it's not cool for me trying to figure out where they're all at. I'm hoping it's still up like kind of near the where the last one was. Oh, it is sick. We have all of our shield parts. I'm gonna go build that. All right, let's make our shield. Oh, it's the origin shield too. Give me that. All right, so we have everything but a key card. I'm gonna go explore the mountain a bit more. There has to be something we're missing. Yeah, this is the top of the mountain up here. I don't see any key cards. There's a spot where I can dig. That just gives me like random items. Oh, I can plant more explosives here. Let's do that. All right, what's past the Wonder Fizz? Oh, it's Pack-a-Punch. I didn't even think to look for Pack-a-Punch. And they got Aether Crystals. Are these breakable? No. I wonder if it's going to be like Cold War Pack-a-Punch on here. Oh, I can actually pick up the crystals. Give me that. Okay, zombie. Okay, now I need to carry these back down near the bunker, they said. There should be some flares where to put them. But I am very, very slow right now. And this area is scary. I'm not dying up here again. I also got a C-58 out of the box. It's called the HK-21 in this, but Cold War would be the C-58. Oh, I think it's right here. Ice crystal. Okay, we need one more. The crystals look so sick. Okay, we got our last crystal. Zombie, if you could please leave me the hell alone. That hurts a lot. Stay back. He's just demolishing my shield right now. I can't run fast enough to get away from him. Stop. Oh, no, I killed him. That's probably what I shouldn't have done. So if I can't outrun one zombie, how am I going to outrun like 40? We're almost at the spot, though. So it's not too bad. Place them. There we go. We placed the crystal. We can finally run now. Left a key card somewhere on the roof of the bunker. We were using it as a research facility. Okay, they said they left a key card on the roof of the bunker. I'll go look for that once I'm done thinning down this round. Oh, it's right here. This key card should open some more lock cabinets containing explosives. You'll need them to take down this facility for good. Okay, so now we need to find another lock cabinet full of explosives so that we can take down the bunker. But what cabinet's locked? The only thing I saw was like the origins door over here. Can I get in here now? So additional parts required. All right, well, where's the other locked cabinet? Oh, right here. There we go. Give me those explosives. Okay. They said that's not it. I need to find more. Oh, here's some more cabinets. Give me that. Give me this. I feel like it'll let me know once I find them all. Oh, I can start placing them. 
There we go. There's another. There's some more explosives in here. I'll grab that. Is this like the, the final part of the Easter egg? This would be really fast if it was. Let's place that down. Another one here. Oh, wait. What? They're going to bring me to the Dark Aether? Let's go. Oh, this is sick. They brought back the Dark Aether. All right, I'm grabbing stamina up. I got a feeling I'm going to be running from something. Okay, it looks like it's still just the one zombie I had. Nope, there's more. There's two. There's three. It's a whole new round, I think. Is that a Megaton I heard spawn? Or is that a Mangler? I heard something spawn. I can't leave. It's like a holdout round. Okay. This is cool. And by cool, I mean terrifying. Oh, there's a little jellyfish out here. It is so purple outside. So purple. Okay. And now we're heading back. So that was fun. Spent a good, like, 20 seconds in the dark aether. It looks really cool. Okay, now we need to go to the extraction zone. I'm going to grab double tap first. I need to hit the box again. My gun's almost out of ammo. Give me that AK. Oh, there is a mangler. Oh, and he's already sleeping. Good try, pal. Where's the exfil point, though? They didn't mark shit for me. I'm just going to assume it's up the mountain. I'm kind of scared to go up there at the start of a round, but we're going to try it. Uh, actually, I'll wait a second. Let me knock down a few zombies first. Is that a panzer? You're not supposed to be here. Oh, and it's not. Cool. <laughs> These elites are stupid easy to kill. They, they captured that part of Cold War. All right, I do really want to try this perk out, but I also want to get Pack-A-Punch. I want to see if it's going to be like Cold War pack camos. All right, let's pack the C-58. Give that here. Okay, so it's not Cold War pack camos, but it does look really cool. I don't think there's any ammo mods either, at least not ones that I can pick like Cold War. Okay, we're kind of just tearing through rounds right now. Let's go grab Power Aid Punch, see what that does, and then PhD as well. Also, no perk limit. Just now noticed after buying my 18th perk. But the reason I grabbed PhD is because there's this little ledge here that you can jump down. I'm going to try it. Oh, okay. We survived. Cool. I thought that was going to be a lot cooler. I thought it was going to, you know, give me a little PhD splash. But nope, I got nothing. Probably because I didn't, you know, flop. I just kind of fell. I'm used to the way Cold War's PhD works. All right, is our exfil point up here? Nope. But we have Elemental Pop, which is $6,000. And I just fell through the floor. Oh, there's a big hole in it. That makes sense. So exfil point right here? Yeah, it is. I'm going to grab PhD first. Then I'll call exfil. All right, not PhD, Elemental. I want to try out Elemental Pop. There we go. All right, let's call exfil. Is that it? Or is this starting a sequence? Looking like it's starting a sequence. Oh, it's Raptor 2. Raptor 1's brother. I'm going to assume the exfil points on top of the mountain. Let's run up there. Oh, yeah. The helicopter's getting closer. I can hear it. Oh, damn. It's really loud. It's the only thing I can hear. Oh, this is why this is here. Let's exfil. Okay. What happened? Did I exfil? I did. All right, we did it. We beat the Easter egg. I'm going to go ahead and cut off that helicopter sound, but that was pretty cool. I, I like that map. It, it was a nice little... It did Cold War justice, I think. It didn't have like a whole lot to do in it, but I think the UI is amazing. The Dark Aether was amazing. Them putting in like the double tap looking Cold War machine or the Cold War looking double tap machine was really cool. They had a few of the weapons. It, it, was, it, was, it was all right. This is what Cold War... Or at least what I think Cold War would have looked like if they added DLC. If they added, like, expansions to maps, which I don't think they would do, but... It's a cool concept to explore. But anyways, that's what Cold War would be like if they added DLC. I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. So if you guys like this, you want to see more, go ahead and leave a like on it. If you didn't and you don't dislike, if you're new here, please consider subscribing for all kinds of content throughout the week. If you want to follow me outside of YouTube, links to my Instagram, my Twitter are down below, as well as a link to my Discord if you want to go ahead and join that. But that's going to be it for me today. I'll see you guys next time. Later.